we will go to the code block and implement this uh, one more time just to repeating what we have uh, done okay so go to code block here we uh, create a new file so let's say I put s uh, l l single link list okay the link list test one dot cpp okay so in here let's say we uh, include some require parameter that we need such as uh, uh, io stream and we have the uh, using namespace but new space std and we have main program like this is just the structure of the program okay the next thing we will create the structure create function to insert begin to list function to display and the main program okay. so we will create a structure we have the node or we can say node or element is y okay because this is representing the box right the box one box one box one box right we just create a simple box so this box contain data let's say data i want to store data uh, if you want to store any other name okay you can put it string uh, titles uh, float score okay you can put any as long as you want to store okay so in here just put only data it's okay so what is required next is the element which is the pointer right so pointer we can just store any name just say p or you can say any other name it's, it's fine right so in this case let's say i call it to next because it's used to point to the next element right we are implementing the single link list so the each element is linked to another one okay so i call it next here so i think that is uh, needed for the element next we will create a structure list structure list so in structure list what we need is uh, the size of the list like they say i uh, have the variable n or you can just put the variable size is okay it represents the size of the list size of the list okay so at first when we create empty list it means that the size is zero right we just set n to zero so in the list we have the elements uh, but we don't store any element right all elements right? we just know what is the head of the list and what is the tail so i put elements head and tail here which is pointer it will uh, connect to the the tail the, the the head and tail of the list so i think that's it uh, required what we need is already the structure element in structure list so next we will uh, call we create a function uh, uh, empty list create an empty list list because uh, it must return a value because we create empty list inside the memory and then it return the address to that block that we use the allocation so we need to uh, specify a return type this is a pointer let's say i call it a name create empty list we can put any name is fine Okay. in the slide we put create list right it's fine so in here uh, when we create the list we don't need uh, anything we can put something like list this is just a variable we need to to reserve memory allocation new uh, list because the type of the list here is uh, list right so we create it as new it's a keyword to reserve allocate memory type is list and then we know that when we get an empty list variable n here the size of the list is zero okay we set initial value zero and then we have the head it does not point to any element because uh, uh, list is empty so head is nil the value of pointer when it does not point to any variable its value is nil okay and then we have the tail called to nil okay and finally we just return the list right because this is the function we must return it 